All right, hello everyone. So in this video, we're covering how to um, do manual and automatic bidding, um, the new bidding strategies that you got to use to um, to get low cost per click um, and to get high reach. All right, so for the bidding strategy that I've been using for, to build to get seven cents a click, three cents a click, they got a three cents a click in this one. Um, I mean, I've built thousands, I've built hundreds of campaigns with like low, very low cost per click. Um, and I'm, I've, I've been doing it um, in all of my ad campaigns for my clients as well. So it's about time I show you how to actually do it. All right. So as you can see here, so with with the last with the last tutorial, if you watched it, um, I showed you how to start creating audiences, but how, at the same time. Um, you need to check how much you would be paying for the audience. So it's all good to get an audience of women, for example, women who are um, regular online buyers. But um, what you want to do is you also want to make sure that you're not you're not going to be paying crazy amounts um, for that particular audience. So what what you want to do is you usually want to have audience insights open in one tab, and then so. You always create your audiences in audience insights. Watch my last video on how to do that. It's pretty, it's quite simple. Um, so you just create an audience insights and you use that in conjunction with this. So let's just go through website traffic. See, so as you can see, I've consistently been getting six cents a click, five cents, five, six cents, seven. 21 what, what was that yeah well i paid 21 cents i have no idea why but nine cents yeah it, it, it just keeps going so the seven cents is just an average of everything from this particular campaign um so this is only one example so now, now i'm going to show you how to actually decide what what, what you should be paying so the method I'd, I'd probably recommend you use is nope this is for my Shopify video. Um, so the, the method I recommend you use is simply add, this is what I recommend. You can start um, start off with manual. I mean, it really depends what kind of budget you have. If you've got a low budget, um, start with manual. Then after getting a low cost per click and good reach change to automatic so usually what i do is i start out with manual and then once it's got um, a decent cost per click like I'm, if i'm seeing regularly five cents a click then what i do is um i just move to um see as you can see look see that i was i was bidding a cents a click for that one so and the recommended was 56 cents per click but the truth is i've actually got a really good historic account there so that's why you always got to make sure you're always making good ads so if you're just making low quality um low quality ads all the time then the the suggested bid is going to go higher see my suggested bid is very low <clears throat> and that's because my ads are always good um, they get very high relevance scores. So it usually starts out with your ads. You gotta make sure you got really good ads to begin with. Um, you need to test out different copies. And and the way the way you decide if your ad is good is is when is if you're getting a good relevance score. So you check your relevance score in the um, within the ad campaign. So let me see here. I think my mouse just disappeared. No idea where it is now. All right, there is. It's, I'm not. It's, it's blinking for some reason. But you just you just go inside your ad campaign. I mean, you add it, and if you look here, it shows you the relevance. See, look, I got a relevance on ten for all of them, which is insane. Because I'm I'm literally getting a ten relevance on each one of them. So, I look, 
it was getting so good that I just paused the six cents one so I can carry on with the five cents. So you know, if, if you got a good ad, um, Facebook is gonna reward you um, as such. So that's why you gotta make sure your ads are good. Uh, the way you get that is through the audience. So I showed you in the last video how to get a good audience. Um, and that the way you do that is you create it through audience insights. You check what what they want, what they're um, what they want to buy through the online online purchase uh, habits and yep so now also what one what we cover now as well is how to um, um, so how much how much should you bid so as you can see for all of these I've only been doing link clicks and I'm I've been mainly focused on link clicks um, um, for my campaigns, but I know a lot of people they do engagements as well. I've done that for other campaigns, but link clicks um, it works well. For me. It just depends what kind of what kind of website you're working with. It just depends on what you're working with, really. Mm. So, when, so as you can see here, the suggested bid was one dollar thirteen. I'm getting six cents a click, but don't don't think that just because you put six cents it's going to work. Um, you got to remember that ads have to be good, the account date has to be good. And so yeah, so just choose link clicks. I'm testing out landing page views and I'll probably put an update on that and how it works. So now I'm just using link clicks. Um, you do the same thing with engagements. Um, in fact, I'll show you one of my recent <clears throat> accounts. I just, it's a, this, this is a brand new account. And I'll still be able to get 0.00, I think like four cents for engagement. Some very low amount. So if we, if we look here, see that we're getting 0 0.004, which is insane, right? So if we if we look here. Well, we're actually getting 0 0.003. See, it just depends on which campaign it is. And all, all I did was, um, I just targeted, <clears throat> I just I just did manual bidding. And that's just to start out with. I know it's a, it's a low spend. I'm just I'm just letting this run for now. But um, but over time, as, as it starts doing better, what I do is I move it to high spend. So I'll probably make it automatic. But once it's automatic, Facebook is going to remember that you've always been getting five cents a click, or I mean, 0 0.004 cents a click. And it's going to be like, all right, so it's always getting that. We can predict in the future it's going to keep getting the same relevance and the same number of um, people engaging with the ad. And you don't, and then I wouldn't be as worried. Whereas if you start out with automatic, what it's going to do is Unless your ad is really good, it really depends. Sometimes it, it depends on how it works. Sometimes it'll just it's it's gonna basically gonna use a suggested bid to begin with, and then once you add, once it realizes your ad is good, um, it will lower it. But that's the that's the thing. In the beginning, you're paying a lot, and then it's gonna lower over time. Whereas my objective is. To do the opposite which is to pay low at the beginning and maybe increase a little bit once it gets to automatic so if you put automatic it's going to use a suggested bid if you put manual you can put your own um your own bid on there but like i said if you, if you add um if your audience is not good your reach is low then what happens is you're not going to get any reach so you know you got to make sure your audience is good i'm not sure why it says 41 million but it is what it is let me see you see yeah i think i think this is a glitch i'm, I'm not sure but yeah don't have 41 million people in your in your audience i think it's more like 20, 29 million people. Yeah, whatever. 
anyway, don't don't worry about it. This is a very this is um, an old rally account. I'm working on some new stuff now. So if you want more details on how I actually get low cost per click and how I get um how I do my manual bidding strategies, if you want detailed training, what you can do is you can just join this group. It's called the Facebook Ads Super Mastermind. What happens is when you join, I'm, um, it adds you to my email list and I'm going to add the files tab here, which is going to include private training videos for you to learn more about how to make more money with Facebook ads and pay less. So it's going to work really well. Um, as you can see, I've only made this account a couple hours ago. One, I made this an hour ago. We've got about five people. Um, so that, that's all there is now for manual bidding. Um, there's a lot to it, so I'll be, I'll be giving a lot more detail in the private videos that I post and future videos. So just make sure you join for now and you'll be added to the e email list as well. And here's my Instagram account, which you can follow. Um, so yeah, that's all there is for now. And peace out.